fucking cool. <laughs> it's Jimbo, baby. guys, how are y'all doing today? Welcome to the video. My name is Jimbo Baby. If you're brand new to the channel, I'm gonna help you out. If you're gonna wanna do, make sure to hit the subscribe button, hit that stupid bell thing. Otherwise, you're never gonna see my videos. And the last thing you're gonna wanna do is give this video a thumbs up. With that, let's talk about the Corvette. As you guys can see, I'm not in the Corvette right now. I am in my baby, my daily driver Altima. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, you know, that car, it just needs work done. It's work that I can't do. It's work that most people can't do at their own house or in their own shop or whatever. It needs to be taken to a professional that can do that kind of work. Unfortunately, you guys aren't gonna be seeing that Corvette for a while. I get, you guys are gonna have to guess in the comments as to why the Corvette's not here. I'm not dropping any hints or anything or telling you guys what happened to the car. All you guys can do is guess. Let me know in the comments what you think is being done to the Corvette, whether it's maintenance or customization. I'm not telling you. But to say the least, that car is getting a big, big overhaul. It's kind of unfortunate to think about it though, because you know, like the car after it comes back, which is gonna be sometime around in February, it's never gonna be the same again. And it's kind of, it's hard for me to think about it like that, but the car is never going to be the same that, you know, it once was when this channel first started. I think back, you know, I had a lot of really good memories with this car just the way it was, you know, bought the car from Chicago, we got it transported back, and it was great, you know, it never had any issues. I mean, yeah, like someone hit the damn car, but that car has been 100% reliable. And guys, I gotta tell you, I don't drive that car lightly. I don't drive it like I drive my Altima here. That thing gets driven hard. And baby, when I say hard, I mean that thing is honed, <laughs> like I'm telling you. So yeah, closer to February, you guys are gonna get a little bit more information as to what's going on with the Corvette. Oddly enough, there's a very similar story between Joe's bike and Jeffrey's Lambo. They're getting work done as well, not necessarily the exact same thing, but it, it's pretty close. Honestly guys, I just cannot wait until they get the car back and I can finally make videos with it again and I can show you what work has been done to it. Anyway, but that's about it when it comes to the Corvette. You know, nothing else is really new, so to speak, with it. Um, one thing I am gonna ask you guys though for, one of the things I wanna do for 2017 is I really do wanna do some kind of, I really wanna do, not like a build, so to speak, uh, but I definitely want to do some work to the car, either make it faster, make it look a little bit different. Um, you know, I've got some ideas, you know, floating around in my head, but I'd like to know your guys' input. Just for me, comment below what mod would be, you know, the most beneficial for my car. I know what a lot of people do to like C4 Corvettes. I'm curious to see what you guys would like out of that car. You know, like one thing I thought of was put a ridiculous wing on the car. Like I know like ricer status immediately. But one of the things I genuinely enjoy is pissing off the rest of the internet. Oh, it doesn't look right to put a giant wing on a Corvette? Oh, perfect, slap a wing on it. I genuinely like making people go like this when they go to a car show. Like, what the hell is that? Call it whatever you want, call it sick, call it stupid. I just call it the way I live. <laughs> well, let me know what you guys think. What mods should I do to the Corvette? What should be done? I don't wanna do anything like outlandishly crazy or anything. I just wanna do something that's gonna make the car my car. You know what I mean? Or like, or something that you guys help me kind of design. Let's change these lanes though. So that's just about it for the vet. I do wanna apologize. I've really had zero upload schedule on this channel for basically the entirety of like the time it's been around, which being that we're about to hit 10k which is amazing by the way 10k face reveal let's do it i really think that one of the things i should do this year is i should really kind of have a structure for when i upload videos um what i want to do i want to upload every day i've said that in the past and i feel bad that every single time i've said it like it's completely gone down the toilet <laughs> every single time i've tried to do it but the reason is you know just things come up but you know that's just one more excuse i really want to try and hold myself to an upload schedule so i think what i'm going to try to do i want to try and upload every single day and I'm, that's what i'm going to try to do whether it's a driving vlog or a cinematic video but i think minimum i'll do you know five uploads a week because I think that would be a good like happy medium because you know I'm not always making YouTube videos you see. Recently life has been changing a little bit. I've started doing a little bit more like freelance work. Like I just, like I said, I just got back from a four day shoot with Rob Ferretti. Who the fuck is honking at me? Yeah, but I've just been doing other work that's not only for my channel. But at the same time, being that I do want to build a much larger YouTube audience, you know, I got to keep 
my YouTube uploads in check. I can't go six days without an upload. Like that's unacceptable. So this video you are seeing the day after the vlog that I posted when I was in Miami. And then tomorrow you'll see another driving vlog, which I'm going to record right after this one in the same clothing and the same sunglasses in the same car. So yeah, for a little while, there's going to be videos that are going to be made in the Ultima. Like I know that driving the Ultima isn't the most exciting thing in the world, granted, but I hope that some of you guys that are watching me aren't just watching for me doing donuts in a Corvette, which if you are, that's 100% fine. I'd do it too. I hope that some of you <laughs> watch just because you might like me. So I know that's a crazy thing to even think about, even saying it, even saying it in my own head, I'm like, why the hell would anybody watch for me? But time will tell, you know, what happens with the upload schedule. Like I said, I'd like to do minimum five uploads a week and try to upload daily. So that's going to be a lot more. I'm going to do more driving vlogs. I might talk about some other topics. Okay, guys, that is it for the video. I think I just saw my mother coming back from my grandparents' house turning onto this road. I want to thank you for watching this video. If you have watched it all the way through, two things I'd like you to do if you haven't done them already. One, make sure you have liked the video and then also hit that subscribe button and hit that stupid bell thing. If you want to see me in the future, that's the only way to do it because YouTube has decided, oh, you know what we're going to do? We're only going to let you occasionally see your, you know, your subscriptions. More on that in another video. With that, guys, I'll talk to you later. All of you have a great day. Thank <laughs> you.